Hello, so um, this week I spent some time looking into a, some kind of spotlight search, as I said on the first day. And um, visually there's not much to that, right? So you just put a search bar in your UI and then you type searching and hope that's the right um, result returns. So far behind um, the scenes, I support three kinds of searches, search for notes, search for actions, and search for um, KC reports, right? And there's one Easter egg, so maybe you can find out later <laughs> what Easter egg it is. Um, and in order to, I mean, searching for actions is pretty simple. I have a list of um, supported actions in an XML file, and then you search for the label, and if it matches, then you get a nice result. Searching for nodes, on the other hand, is a little bit more complicated because you want to basically search for everything related to a node, right? So you want to search for any node in a certain category or any node associated with a certain asset field or a geolocation or if a certain node had a certain service or whatever you can imagine. So let's, for example, see what is running in Fulda, right? So I get a result of five nodes because I need to limit the result basically, otherwise I get, if I have 10,000 and 1,000 match, I can't really use it. Um, there's also a more button you can see, so there are more results than four, but the more button is not implemented yet. And you see the result is weighted because yeah, we have multiple results for uh, the IT full open OS node for two matches, so it shows up a little bit more up or further um, up in the list did you uh i know you haven't done this yet but it'd be kind of cool if uh oh. you had some way of uh like if yeah that's possible if you can... had an alarm right now that it would show up higher yeah something that's you know... yeah yeah um also you can use the filter api so let's say cat ink oops pro and cat uh cat ink Okay. Then you have that criteria, or let's say you want to uh, click add a node, then you can just go and go to that page. Or you know, I have um, certain nodes with a lot of RAM, so you can just search for that field um, and go into to that instance. I don't know why it's so slow. Or let's say. Uh, there are some in the Donaustrasse, so basically look for them, or um, let's search for an IP address is also possible, anything you want, or if you know the foreign. Um, sure. You mean with asterisk? No, I ripped that out because it's too limiting, so just type in. I mean, I can add it again, but the problem was you always had to type in the full IP address and that sucked. So we can add it later again for specific use cases. Um, I'm looking for the foreign ID, but I can't find it. Where is it? Ah, uh, yes. So if I look for that, it's allowed to also automatically show up. Um, and you can just type in log out. I think we're done for the day. <laughs> That's all I have for.